write the pin said what should I write he said write everything that will ever happen until the end which is perpetuity the Prophet وسلم, after Isra al Miraj he came back what did he say about that pin he said the pin has been lifted the ink has become dry and that book is with Allah that book is what all every year Allah reveals his qadr for. That book the Torah came from. That book the Injil came from. That book the Quran came from. And somewhere in that book, Allah wrote your name. He wrote your name. And said that He would create you. Who your parents would be. What you would be. And then He wrote Muslim. He willed it for you. I used to think that I came to Islam, you know, through, through my efforts of studying the Bible. He wrote it. It's written. Maktub, it was written by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. I had done nothing 50,000 years before existence. Allah willed that you would be a Muslim. It's a favor. It's an honor. And whatever I have to go through on this path of being a Muslim is an honor. When Allah grants me goodness, it's an honor. It's a favor for Him and I'm thankful for it. When Allah puts me through difficulty, it's an honor. It's an honor to go through it because I'm, I'm going to learn something from it on the other side. Even if you fail, brothers and sisters, you make mistakes, it's an honor if you learn from it. If you learn from it, if you learn from it and become wiser because of it, it is not a mistake, it is a lesson. And we all need these lessons in life. So hold your head up high, chin out, smile on your face, because you have been given something that is the most precious thing that can ever exist on the face of this planet, and it's intangible. It's guidance. It's guidance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Why are you tested? The question is, why should you not be tested? That should be the real question. When people come and ask me, why is Allah testing me? My response is, ask yourself, why shouldn't you be tested? If you can give me five reasons why you deserve, amongst all of creation, not to be tested, and that makes the person think, wait a minute, you're right. I don't really, in, in, in the reality of things, I probably deserve more than anybody else to be tested by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So take it all with a grain of salt and thank Him for every single thing. Because anything from Him towards you is goodness for you if you believe. بارك الله فيكم جميعا والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته